I'm Bill Harrison. I'm founder of Harrison Design. My role in the project was to conceptualize the architecture and the plan for the renovation and sort of serve as the advisor on it. And then Frank is the uh, architectural designer. I work for Bill at Harrison Design mm -hmm. and the project manager of the construction and design of the home. As a renovation, it the design process grows as the, as you learn more about the house and learn more about what kind of how the house wants to live. Looking at the initial property and the fact that it hadn't really been maintained since 1955 when the house was built, it was overgrown. As you look out the window now, you see it's almost a park-like setting. And a lot of that had to be opened up. I think the biggest surprise was the front porch. and. The fact that it's a nice big wide, it's really a room, it's open to the outside. And it became more and more apparent that it had the best views, it had the best location. It was a place and time that you would spend more and more time on because it's a protected covered area with a fantastic restful view. I think one of the best things you did was I was standing out there laying the porch out with you <laughs> and you go, take one more step. And I took one step further out to make the porch just a little bit wider and it makes it like you said, a room, a useful room that connects the whole front of the house together. The clear story in the kitchen is particularly nice, tracking the sun throughout the day. Being in the house as much as we were during construction, you kind of learned what time the sun was going to hit different spots of the kitchen, that was pretty fun. The structure of this is honest. In other words, the main dining room, that's an honest timber structure. The kitchen's that. The master bath in particular drove sort of this zen feeling. So it tells you it's a quiet space, but it's not a restrictive space. Because when you go in there, your sense of space, you're contained with everything around you. There is no real barrier exterior. But what you do and what happens to you in there, you feel very quiet about it. And so it's a calming space. It's a restful space. 